Welcome to a MainlyDIY.com video. Hi, so today we're going to uh, make a candy sleigh and I'm starting with some uh, miniatures, chocolates, and um, some uh, Christmas uh, type paper. And I am, I'm going to start with seeing about how long my candy bar is. It is, um, and I'm, I'm trying to measure uh, the top of the bar, probably about like that, because I'm going to use this silver, let that show. So I'm kind of measuring on this one, it would be the, the yellow, the length of the yellow. So I am getting about an inch and a quarter. So I'm going to take uh, some paper and cut it up at an inch and a half and I'm um, taking a small stack here and um, I'm going to cut an inch and a half. It doesn't have to be real precise but I like using my rotary cutter just because that's easy to do for me. So I'm using my ceramic blade here. Um, this is paper. You can use um, cardstock. This is a great way to use some leftovers cardstock. And I am going to take a candy bar and I am going to wrap my paper around it. And um, I can just trim off the excess so I figure out about how much I need and then I can tell you. So I'm just going to clip that off because now I know about how much I need. So um, that's almost three inches, so I'm going to cut my stack at three inches. So I have a stack of paper cut at three inches, and I am just going to take and I am going to wrap candies with, with my paper. So I'm just wrapping it around and I'm just going to uh, just put a little piece of cellophane tape on the bottom because that's not going to show. Um, that's going to be hidden so it doesn't have to be anything special. But you do want to uh, put your tape on the bottom. And this is uh, maybe a good way to get rid of some of the um, the, the uh, paper that you may not like so well. Like that one's not that pleasing to me, but um, it will work fine in this project. Um, this one would be too busy for most of my work, but uh, it works very well in this project. So we have some candies wrapped. So next I'm going to wrap a Kit Kat bar. I'm going to measure my Kit Kat bar. I'm getting about three and a half inches. So I'm measuring my Kit Kat bar from here to here and that's about three and a half inches. So I am going to cut, um, make this three and a half inches wide. And then I am going to wrap my Kit Kat bar in the same manner that I had done before. Okay. So I have a sleeve on all of my uh, chocolate and then I'm going to need Then I'm going to need two candy canes, and those are going to be my sled runners. And uh, so I am going to um, just kind of position those where I want to get a feel for it. That looks about good. Okay, so I made a line of hot glue on low temperature and put my candy cane runners on the back side of my sled. And then I glued on these cute little pom-poms. 
and then I am laying out where I think I want my uh, candy to be because it's going to stack up something like this. So I've got that figured out. I'm just going to put a... So I'm going to start with the one that goes in the middle and I'm going to put a little bit of glue on. Again I'm using low the low temperature setting on my glue gun. Just putting enough to tack it on. So then I'm going to take a piece of ribbon and uh, wrap it around, see how much I need. And I'm not worrying that I'm being I'm not being careful cutting that off because I'm going to put something right over the top of it. Um, so I'm going to put just a hair of glue on top there, just a little bit, probably more than I wanted, but. And so I am going to uh, trim off a little bit because I have more overhanging because I want that to kind of be in the in the center where that comes together on the top. I'm going to cut just a hair more off. There we go. Okay, and then I'll just put a uh, another little, hopefully a little spot of glue this time. There we go. Wrap my ribbon up there tight and put that down. And then I'm going to find a pretty little bow to put on there. Some little bows here that have sticky dots on them, but the sticky dots don't always stay with them. But um, So I'm going to test out how I like that one. I think that looks fine just like that. So I'm going to go ahead and um, actually just put a hair of glue on that because that sticky dot didn't stay with the bow. So. And I'll put that right on there, and then we have a little uh, candy sled all done. Okay, so here's my little sled. Here's another one that I did uh, at a different time. This one I uh, just tied a knot in my ribbon. I used a narrow ribbon. I uh, made a little gift tag for it, um, so I didn't have a bow on that one, but um, same idea. So two versions of the same thing.